Ana Luis González. Today we are going to talk about what is water pollution, types of water pollution, its main causes, effects, and some interesting facts. Also, we are going to take you to a contaminated river. Hope you enjoy. Let's begin. <laughs> <laughs> Contamination of water bodies, such as lakes, rivers, oceans, aquifers, and groundwater, is very often caused by human activities. This occurs when pollutants, such as chemicals and substances, are thrown into water bodies without enough treatment to get rid of harmful compounds. Pollutants get into water mainly by human causes or factors. Water covers over 70% of Earth's surface. It is a very important resource for people and the environment. Water pollution affects drinking water, rivers, oceans, and lakes all over the world. In many developing countries, it is usually a leading cause of death by people drinking from polluted water sources. More to this, water pollution affects not only individual living species, but also populations and the entire ecosystem that exists in the water. Now humans have realized the importance of cleaning water. More and more organizations are working to educate, protect, and encourage practices that help keep water from contamination and also the preserved water ecosystem from destruction. <laughs> about the types of water pollution. The first one is the nutrient pollution. This happens because the sewage and pollutants have high levels of nutrients. These nutrients make the weed and algae grow. This will make the water undrinkable for humans and also it will be very harmful for the aquatic creatures. Surface water pollution. This pollution is caused by the contact of the harmful substances such as chemicals with the surface water. Oxygen depleting. When biodegradable matter ends up in water, it encourages the microorganisms to grow and they consume many oxygen, so this may cause the death of the aerobic organisms. Groundwater pollution. When humans use chemicals and pesticides on the soil, they later seep into the ground because of the rain and this causes the underground pollution. Microbiological. This type of water pollution is caused by microorganisms such as virus, bacteria, and many other organisms. This can cause the death of many aquatic species and also can cause serious illness to humans. Matter. Some pollutants settle in the ground of the water and this can harm or even kill aquatic life that lives in the ground of that water. <laughs> chemical water pollution. The chemical wastes of the farmers and industries ends up in the water and this affects the development of aquatic life and may kill them. Oil spillage. Oil spill can cause the death of many fish and also zippers since they lose their ability to fly. Some causes of water pollution are industrial waste. Industries cause huge water pollution uh, with their activities. Industries throw their waste to the water bodies and these substances are very dangerous and poisonous to animals and humans. Some substances are sulfur, um, nitrates and phosphates found in fertilizers, uh, lead, mercury, which, are, which cause environmental and health problems, and these substances are thrown in the habitat for many animal species and the sources of water for many humans. Ocean and marine dumping. In some countries, uh, objects like glass, uh, paper, aluminium and other products are dumped into the oceans and rivers. And these products take even hundreds of years to be decomposed. Oil spills are also very influenced in the water pollution. 
because they stay for a long time in the water and they move around the river very quickly. Sewage and water waste. In some unknown developed countries like Venezuela, sewage, which is water and soluble waste, is not treated and is thrown in the oceans and rivers. This is extremely dangerous and harmful for people because this brings a lot of diseases. Effects. The effects of water pollution can be catastrophic, depending on the kind of chemicals, concentration of the pollutants, and where is the pollution. The results of water pollution are that many water bodies near urban areas are highly contaminated by the causes that were previously mentioned. Death of aquatic animals. One of the main problems of water pollution is that the death of aquatic animals that live on these polluted water bodies. Among these animals we can find fish, crabs, dolphins, birds and seagulls. Disruption of the food chain. Pollution disrupts the food chain as well. When pollutants such as lead and mercury are consumed by tiny animals, these animals get infected and the higher levels of the food chain that eat them get contaminated and diseases too. Diseases. Humans are affected by this process too. People can get diseases such as hepatitis by eating seafood that has been contaminated and there can be an outbreak of diseases like cholera and diseases as a result of poor drinking water treatment from contaminated waters. Destruction of the ecosystem. The ecosystems can be severely changed or even destroyed by water pollution. Areas affected by careless human pollution that provide food or anything to consume for us gets to affect us and our surroundings in a small period of time. Now we're gonna go to the contaminated river La Guairita. So let's go. No party. <laughs> <laughs> Visit American City, you will find it very pretty. Just two things of which you must beware. Don't drink the water and don't breathe the air. Pollution, pollution, they got smog and sewage and mud. Turn on your tap and get hot and cold running crud. See the halibuts and the sturgeons being wiped out by detergents. Fish gotta swim and birds gotta fly, but they don't last long if they try. Pollution, pollution, you can use the latest toothpaste and then rinse your mouth with industrial waste. <laughs> Just go out for a breath of air And you'll be ready for Medicare The city streets are really quite a thrill If the hoods don't get you, the monoxide will Pollution, pollution Wear a gas mask and a veil Then you can breathe Long as you don't inhale of things there that you can drink but stay away from the kitchen sink the breakfast garbage that you throw into the bay they drink at lunch in San Jose so go to the city see the crazy people there like limes to the slaughter they're drinking the water and breathing <laughs> the air to this river, we can smell the awful odor that is coming from it. Also, we can see that it's very contaminated and uh, this uh, river can bring diseases. And you can see the nearby buildings that are affected by this, uh, this river. This building that we just saw is a building that has a lot of offices. 
which throws away all of their wastes into the river. One man, what happened to her plan? <laughs> 